has been months since we started our fight against COVID-19. Throughout these tough times, our healthcare teams have learned to embrace the challenges, making us stronger and more resilient against the disease. Good day! My name is Dr. Lilibeth Maravilla, and I'm your doctor for today. Let me walk you through our new normal inside a QualiMed Health Network facility. But first, let's all wear our face mask and face shield. Inside our facilities, our COVID and non-COVID areas are strategically and physically separated. Some facilities are isolated through air exchanges and some through negative air exchange equipment. This is to make sure that air is contained within the COVID areas, keeping our non-COVID areas safe from possible contamination. We also have walkways and elevators exclusive for COVID-related cases. Our COVID-related zone, which we call Area 19, has operating room, isolation areas, intensive care unit, and other services exclusive for COVID-related cases. We have admission rooms exclusive for COVID-related cases in Area 19. To better protect our healthcare teams, our Area 19 is also equipped with the donning and doffing area and with our compliance officers so our workers can safely and properly wear and remove their personal protective equipment. As a recent addition to our capabilities, each of our hospitals now has a molecular laboratory. This provides COVID-related testing such as RT-PCR test. For better containment of infection, our RT-PCR laboratories are located outside our hospitals. With this service, COVID testing is now more accessible to the community we serve, providing better monitoring and control of the disease. For admissions and surgery, we require all patients and their companion to undergo RT-PCR testing. This is to help ensure that our non-COVID areas are safe from possible infection from our patients. Our healthcare workers also benefit from our own COVID testing capabilities. With risk-based COVID testing, we are able to control infection in our team, making services and operations safer within our facilities. We do this because we believe that our healthcare workers need to be well so they can serve you better and safer. We're doing all we can to implement ways and means to keep you safe in our facilities. Always remember, when your safety comes first, your wellness follows.